Okay, joined by Maddie Kenny here at Parnell Park. Maddie, a fantastic game of hurling here against Waterford this afternoon to uh, start the Allianz Hurling League. What's your assessment of the result and the performance? Yeah, look at uh, you know Waterford came out a strong team today, and uh, you know, it was uh, hugely competitive out there. And uh, we started with uh, the con conditions that were back, you know, so it was a difficult, difficult evening for hurling and a difficult day for hurling. The pitch cut up a little bit but um, in that first half you know we wanted to build up a little bit of a lead uh, when we had the conditions but uh, the the penalty that Waterford got uh, kind of broke our momentum but in fairness to the guys you know they the, the, the re-established control of that first half and uh, built, built the scoreboard and I think we went in four or five pints up but probably wasn't enough on, uh, on, on an evening where it was such a strong breeze uh, that uh, the opposition had for the second half. Yeah um, you met obviously very very strong in the first half you, you must be delighted though with the character shown in that second half because Waterford came at the team in that last 15-20 minutes of the game and he fought back very strongly uh, obviously led in, in the last couple of minutes as well so you must be very happy with that character shown yeah so Waterford came out in the second half they got the, the, the first two scores uh, I think brought it down to a three point game but yeah, we went up and you know built the scoreboard again Got a little bit of control back in the game, um, even though we're facing that wind. But you know, we, get, we conceded another penalty then in the second half, uh, and another black card. So we got two black cards and a red card in the one day. So uh, look, at, we, we played a lot of the time, I suppose, in with 14 men. But you know, as you said, the guys showed massive, massive uh, character. You know, to, to stay in the game and, and dig out, dig out a result. Maybe not fully the result we wanted, but you know, I think maybe the end of the day, a draw was was fair on both sides. But right through that second half, I think that the home crowd, you know. You know, I think the lads fed off that a bit, like massive support in here and massive noise from the Dublin supporters there in the second half. And I think they were kind of the, the 16th man and maybe 15 men when we were down to 14. But um, you know, I think I think it was great that the crowd got behind us and uh, like it was good entertainment. Not not perfect conditions against you know fluent hurling, but I think both sides showed uh, great determination and great attitude. And our shows, our guys showed massive character, as I said, uh, to get something out of the game and to finish up. Uh, it's been a good start to the year, obviously winning the Welsh Cup. It's a good start to the uh, league here uh, today as well uh, with the draw and it's straight into game two next weekend against Antrim up in Belfast. Another tough test to wait for yourselves. Yeah, so Corrigan Park is, is a tough place to go. Like, you know, like uh, Wexford and, and, and Clare re, re, really, really um, uh, found that last year. Like, you know, so Antrim had a good result today, and even though they didn't get the win. Like, you know, they went down to, to Nolan Park and came away with a narrow loss, but I, I heard they played really well. So, like, yeah, we're under no illusions like what we're facing up. They're going up to Corrigan Park next weekend. Uh, a, a good Antrim team. They're getting better uh, as, 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 as they go along. And uh, it's going to be a big test for us. And, uh, you know, look at, picked up a few knocks there today. So, like, like, you know, early this week now we just got to get on top of them knocks and get everyone refreshed and uh, get on the road next Saturday and uh, we're looking forward to it.